Zay, today clean up, clean up day. Get off the game. There's trash outside. They gotta go to the car. Alright, so I am packing up to move in like 10 days. I have a lot of stuff in my basement. A lot of it belongs to my mom. I am looking through it and just saying goodbye and getting rid of it. You recording? And in the midst Where's of shame? going through some pictures right there. I found some partials. Yeah, partials. Did you know, did you know I had fake teeth? I got some teeth back here pulled. They were trying to do a root canal and they fractured the tooth. So they had to pull it out. And then I needed another root canal and I said no, no, no. Because that <laughs> put me in so much pain. I had them to pull it. Same thing happened up here. I didn't have no cavities until after I had my mark. Then my mouth was full of cavities. I don't know if it was him or not. I feel like because I let the dentist say, hey, you got a cavity. And then he pulled it out. And then next thing you know, I'm having toothaches and stuff. Who knows? Anyway, I get a lot of cavities in between my teeth. They say from not flossing. So floss. Anyway, these are the two bottoms. They call partials. Um, they even got my initials on the inside. But they're not really teeth. They just put a little white stuff up here just so to see. But the purpose of the partials is to keep your teeth from <coughs> moving to fill the gap. So it's been probably two years since I wore these. I'm pretty sure they're probably not gonna fit. Moment of truth. And then I have the one up top. Kind of tight, just like when I first got it. But they actually still fit. I didn't push it all the way down in there because that's why I stopped wearing them. When I pushed them all the way down, they hurt. They were very tight. Had I been wearing them the last two years, they probably wouldn't be tight no more. But you hear how I talk? That's how I was talking then too. Same thing with the top. This. Oh, the way they made. I don't know if I said it already. They can add on to them. So, as I get older and lose teeth, do to not properly floss. Because I do have more cavities that I never got filled because the dentist be making me cry. They can add on. Put that back upstairs. Uh-huh, uh-huh, I bet y'all didn't know Zay be that nice to his little brother and sister sometimes. He do it a lot like out in public when I'm not around. I get told all the time how he's such a good big brother. That's why I do a lot for him. I reward him for it. And when he around the house yelling at my kids and calling them stupid, he does that. I get in his face about it. Mama, I can't get, get this one in. This was the one that hurt me the most. It's kind of like how I said I'm Captain scared to push this one all the way down and right because of the pain that it was in. But this top one put me in the most pain that I'm so scared to put it in. Y'all probably like, would you just put the teeth in already? It hurts. I, I didn't push it all the way in. It's right here. It's the fake teeth. Um, I'm sure my teeth definitely move. Maybe I can try wearing these for so many hours a day to help them sit back in place. I'm going to try. Um, some of y'all probably already know this. Some of y'all probably wonder. Some of y'all probably never paid attention. Hold on. Some of y'all probably never paid attention. Because like me, you could tell me something wrong with you. And I could have been watching you for years and never noticed. Because sometimes, I mean, I don't look at stuff like that. Same thing with Carlton. When Carlton draw, he draws head, legs, and stuff. And the teacher told me that he draw like that because that's how he see people. He just see their face and they that is a person he don't like look at details but when I draw I do draw details I learned that in art, art class because I just love to draw faces and putting details in faces but anyway the whole of my tongue and I'm I'm sorry that my tongue look like this I'm drinking coffee right now uh, 
I used to have a tongue ring. As a matter of fact, my tongue been pierced twice. I should have put that in one of the, I stopped doing all the videos on the community tab because I didn't know what else I wanted to share that y'all might not know. But oh well. I once had my tongue pierced twice. I had it done. It hurt it so bad. I took it out. And then like a month later, I went back and got, got it done again. I was uh like 15 probably. And I don't know. One day I just said, I'm going to get my tongue pierced. Never wanted my tongue pierced. I said I wanted to know how much pain I can take. And I thought getting your tongue pierced would be the most pain that you can ever take. And hey, that was my teenage years. So. Anyway, when I got it done the second time, every time I eat, Sometimes my tongue goes sideways and the food feels so good. I would bite down on that bar and I had bit down on it so many times it was always ripping my tongue. And I remember one day eating some cereal and I bit down on that bar and my tongue hurt it so bad that I took it out and I was done. But I'm left with the extra skin from all the times I ripped it. And even if I turn my tongue right there. That was the exit room. No, I can't just stick a tongue room straight in there. But I can put what in there it then has like a thin piece of skin that won't go all the way through same thing if i try to go in from that way i'm pretty sure i can pop it and push it all the way through safely but i'm 34 years old i don't need to see me so. here goes an hour awareness <coughs> can you smell like Ooh. Dang, can he just put you on front? I'm recording. He just told everybody that you smell like boo boo. Dang. <laughs> do you really smell like boo boo or was you playing? He do. Oh, you got your mama ring on the floor. Y'all, these videos coming up later in the future, like way later. So you probably gonna be like, moo, what, what, boo, boo. If you stay with me, it'll come. It probably won't even be next month that it's gonna come, but. It'll come. Why are you so hairy? Anyway, I just wanted to say hi. It's been a little bit since I uploaded, so. Hi. I'm just a mama for. Find on your face. Look, there's a spot.